God, our Heavenly Father, Lord Jesus Christ, our Savior, O Holy Spirit, the power from above, we worship you, we adore you, and we glorify you. brothers and sisters in Christ we take a few moments in the presence of the lord just to worship our lord with all our heart mind and soul for it is in him that we moved it is in in his mercy that we have reached this point of our life and he is our god and lord he is our father we are his children he has called us into his love to glorify him through our lives glorify him on the earth as his children let us spend a few moments experiencing the presence of the lord and worshiping the lord for war, for he is our god Thank you Abba Father for adding one more day into our life And as we look forward into our life especially of this day we see your hands holding us tight protecting and providing and giving us the blessings that we stood in need of thank you lord we worship you lord we adore you lord
and every time when we acknowledge your presence in our life when we acknowledge your providence when we acknowledge your blessings in our life it always leads us to thanksgiving it always leads us offering ourselves unto you once again so lord we acknowledge your hand in our life thanking you and surrendering ourselves unto you including all our daring needs all our needs that are dear to our heart knowing that you are with us knowing that you provide for us knowing that you are our father and every day when we come into the presence of the lord especially for these moments of adoration and benediction and we acknowledge all the blessings he has given us thanking him and surrendering ourselves once again unto him we also share our desire with the lord that we would like to stay close to you o oh lord we would like to be yours all through our life dear brothers and sisters that is our response to our heavenly father who is drawing us all to himself It is our response to our heavenly father who always comes in search of us who is always interested in our well-being who is always interested in our bright future who is always stretching out his hand upon us to protect to heal and to deliver us Thank you Lord. We worship you Lord. We adore you Lord. Almighty Father Sometimes when we humanly look at our life of this day there were certain areas where we were not satisfied certain areas of our life where we regret that we could have done better certain areas of our life especially in our spirituality we would have said no to certain temptations but lord 
at the end of the day even when we recollect all these negative things in our life we know that you are with us we know that even when those prayers of our heart are not answered present we know that you give us the blessings that we stand in need of thank you abba father thank you lord and lord we also would like to acknowledge that if we had done anything good in our life this day anything in charity any good word or deed we know that is from the inspiration and the strength of the holy spirit thank you lord for anointing us with your holy spirit for guiding us with your holy spirit strengthening us with your holy spirit thank you lord we worship you we adore you and we glorify you let your name be glorified always and everywhere let your kingdom come we pray o lord and lord we as we go ahead in every step of our life as we progress in our spiritual journey and our physical journey on this earth we pray draw us close to you o lord to enjoy the love of your heart to have the peace and joy of your heart in our own lives in our own family Thank you Lord.
and sisters now let us intercede for the whole world Today being the memorial day of Saint Francis Xavier. Let us remember all the missionaries working for Christ, becoming good, good news of Christ around the world, especially those places where they're being persecuted for the faith they process, profess. We pray for them more strength, more trust in the Lord. Thank you, Lord, for sending people with the heart of your Son to bring good news to the whole world. Let us also pray for the whole world. With one heart and one faith, we pray for the healing of the whole world. Especially at this time of pandemic. We ourselves know that so many in the world, maybe all of us in the world are struggling at this time. For different reasons arising from this COVID-19 pandemic and its impacts. We 
we remember all of them praying for lord's mercy and healing upon the world God our heavenly father from divine retreat center summer's be we lift up now all the prayer intentions that we have received today here as comments to the online services all those who reached out to divine retreat center through different media all those who visited us today prayed with us today and prayed interceding for the whole world in our intercession chapel and all the intentions dear to the heart of our brethren joining us together at this time of worship and benediction lord have mercy upon all those prayer intentions Thank you Abba Father. Dear brothers and sisters, we request your prayers now. For tomorrow's first Friday evening service here at Divine Retreat Center Summers B. From 6 p.m. to 8:30 p.m. first Friday of the month. all those who have booked in for this day the service and all those who are leading the service all the aspect of it Lord, we pray let your hand of protection and anointing be evident in every moment of that service thank you lord Let us once again offer all our prayer intentions unto the Lord. And dear brothers and sisters, before we enter into the moments of benediction, we would like to bring into your attention that tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. we will not be having holy mass streamed online. also the evening adoration at 9 pm there will not be adoration tomorrow evening but we will have the first friday service live streamed from 8 pm sorry 6 pm to 8:30 pm Now let's all kneel down before our Lord preparing for the moments of benediction singing together down in adoration falling
let us pray lord jesus christ you gave us the eucharist as the memorial of your suffering and death may our worship of this sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you won for us and the peace of the kingdom may you live with the father and the holy spirit one god forever and ever amen Let us recite the divine praises together. Blessed be God. Blessed be his holy name. Blessed be Jesus Christ, true God and true man. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Blessed be his most sacred heart. Blessed be his most precious blood. Blessed be Jesus in the most holy sacrament of the altar. Blessed be the Holy Spirit, the Paraclete. Blessed be the Great Mother of God, Mary, Most Holy. Blessed be her holy and immaculate conception. Blessed be her glorious assumption. Blessed be the name of Mary, Virgin and Mother. Blessed be Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse. Blessed be God in his angels and in his saints. Amen. Oh, praise and all thanksgiving.